Howdy, practical patriots and practical preppers. Yachate, Ross, Alice, Texas. Hey, folks, John Practical Nurse here, and I got a challenge. It is from BC Bottoms, who basically wanted me to list my five everyday carry items. So, some of you, when I mention these, some of you may go, ha, <laughs> and some of you go, hmm, I didn't think of that before. But let's roll on here. My first everyday carry item before I head out, before I do anything else, right here. No, not the great head of hair at the age of 54, but my mind, folks. My mind has got to be set and ready to rock, okay? Uh, before I head out every day, before I get behind that wheel, this right here has got to be okay with the world. Uh, to do that, I spend a little bit of time praying, meditating every day, uh, because if it's not, I get to see the end of result when it's somebody else that doesn't have their mind right and they get behind the wheel. They get distracted, text on their phone, answer a phone, uh, not paying attention to the road, and then I get, in my occupation, basically the end result of that. So that's the first thing that's got to be right right here. And this is get coupled with this right here, folks, okay? My heart. Uh, basically, you know, I, I examine everything from every point of view, you know, what I think about it, what I feel about it. I don't really ever go with a parse expression of gut instinct because I know that some people let uh, a bad incident get behind them or it kind of curves something, you know, and it kind of curbs what that gut instinct actually is, is saying. But we'll get into an instinct later on if you want to in another video. But this right here, coupled with this right here, has got to be ready to rock when, as I'm heading out that door. The next item on my EDC list is this right here, my Gerber, okay? I carry this thing with me everywhere. It never ceases to amaze me how often in a day I use this. Somebody needs my knife, my scissors, my pliers, or anything. Uh, I've had these since I was in the military. It is tradition to uh, hand these off to a soldier as you're getting out, but I had a hard time doing that because of every place this thing has been with me. So someday I'll, I'll hand these off, someday, okay? But that's my next item. Next item on my everyday carry uh, list. Of some form or fashion, folks, I got to have a first aid kit or an eye pack. I'm amazed at the little town that I live in, I get noticed or recognized a lot. Some law enforcement officer will go like this at me and point, that means you come here, pull over, and go over there where there's something bad happening. So I always carry a first aid kit in my car. I always keep my eye pack with me. Uh, when I'm at work, I got my pocket stuff full of items I'm going to use uh, as I run my day to the shift. But always, 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 folks, I got some form of first aid kit. Okay? Next item. Some of you may snicker about this, but I carry it with me every day. My reading glasses. All right? Because of my age, because of my age, folks, I got to have these. Okay? Uh, it, again, Little town, it never ceases to amaze me how often while I'm waiting in line at Walmart, HEB, Academy, you know, lumber store, something like that, somebody recognizes me and they want me to look in their kid's throat because they think they've got strep throat or something. You know, <laughs> I'm amazed at the questions I asked. Or uh, a few times I've actually had to help law enforcement identify a pill. You know, they, they found a bottle of pills and Johnny, can you tell us what these are? You know, well, sure. Let me look in your kid's throat. Let me look at your pills. Let me look for lines and everything, you know. But it does happen. So I've got to be able to see. Plus, you never know. Some hot prepper grandma may uh, ask me to look in her ear when she's uh, thinking she's got a earache. Okay? Hey, don't take my dreams away from me. Okay. <laughs> okay, so that's one, two, three, four. Fifth and final item, folks, is something I hope I never have to use. Okay, it's my Taurus, Taurus 40 cal. All right, my old beat up 24 seven. It is my an everyday carry item that I have. Okay, it goes with me to a lot of different places. Um, you know, people want to debate me when they when they hear 40 cal. Uh, that's fine. I tell people whatever bullet works for you, whatever gets shots on targets for you. And plus, okay, if you want to get really nippy about it, how about we talk about how many bullet wounds I have seen compared to how many bullet wounds the person debating me has seen. Okay? That's how I look at it. Uh, coupled with a really awesome holster that I got from a company called Tactical Measure right here where I live, my hometown. Uh, really awesome holster. Holds on tight. Uh, really set up well, folks. I mean, to, I'm, I'm going to try to remember to uh, put their link in the item description uh, tactical measure. These are really awesome holsters, and I hope to get Doug on here one time to talk about about these. And really, folks, BC Bottoms, 
made a comment about, uh, he goes, you really need to watch this guy's uh, five everyday carry items because he's always going to include something funny in there. Well, <laughs> the glasses were kind of it, but here's another thing. I noticed when I first became, uh, uh, made my YouTube channel that I was kind of getting a lot of comments from trolls. Trolls, gotta love them folks, they've got nothing better to do than to sit in their mom's basement, type criticism, they don't go outside to get exercise, they rarely see the light of day, they've probably never been on a range, okay, or never done all the really cool stuff that we, that you and I get to do. But there is always a comment about my hair, and not to disappoint them, but I swear to you, this is not one of my five everyday carry items. <laughs> It is not. You may think it is, but it's not. All right, excuse me, just a second. Yeah, that's good. All right, <laughs> just throwing a bonus here, folks. Something else I carry with me every day. How about a sixth item? That confidence that comes with being educated, middle-aged, and experienced. How'd you like that one? All right, so my job is to now call out five people that I want to know what their five everyday care uh, items are. Uh, everyday carry. How about Trey Jurgen? Want to know what yours are? Come, coming from a young uh, Second Amendmenter. Lady Farmer, always respect everything that you do and everything that you are, okay? Because you always have a really interesting point of view. Uh, Prepper Princess, just like me, always on a budget, always trying to save money, always being practical. Want to know what you do. Uh, let me see, Delaware Patriot. Love your content, brother. It's really awesome. Want to know what your five EDCs are. And, of course, Coda Boy 32 always rocking there. Thank you so much, John, for being an awesome YouTuber. If you've already done this before, then just kind of ignore. But kind of curious what uh, you have. If you have done it, just point to me the link or now. I'll go watch it, okay? Until I see you all again, questions and comments, leave them below. I'm Johnny the Practical Nurse. Out here.